Hello YouTube, welcome to episode 21 of the Rise of Iceland series, here with Damien. Now it's a very special episode because we're actually doing this episode whilst on stream. So if you want to follow me on stream, link in the description below. Um, currently in the middle of stream, I've only been in stream for a little bit because we're only going to stream basically the uh, knockout games. Um, but I thought these games are probably too important, not you know, too important for you guys not to see on YouTube as well. So we're currently on stream, we've got the one day to get to, and I thought of since it's our first time in the knockout rounds, let's do the press conference. HK, divide the or oh, how much further do you think you can go? Look, uh, we're, we're here to enjoy the ride because we're probably going to get pumped. Um, is that what I said to how many? Um, I'm just focusing on the match itself. The guy will, no comment. We don't. Are we all a good team? Yes, but we're back as well. Do well. Look, it's going to be a fairly tricky, important game. I don't think it's affected. Far from business, I'm, you know. The fact that coaches can crack over the head, so I don't know, I don't care how his hand went, frankly. I'm just concentrating on making sure we're prepared for the match ahead. But I don't care what my other coach thinks. He could be handing it like, like crap and still uh, manage quite good. Um, HK takes silence as golden, or well, mainly because I'm never leaving, so they don't need to worry. As Milan and Chelsea, and Chelsea getting him out of the way, though. Olympic on Leverkusen definitely have a very interesting tie ahead. Leverkusen is. Uh, Put quite the squad. They definitely built the squad. Apologies for the yawning. Now, Marcelo Garcia. We could do this right now, but we've got a Red Bull game to get to, so we won't. Um, as you can see, everyone's like, ooh, where's all the links? Don't worry. I've rested the team in the game previous in the first game of the preseason cup, which we won quite easily. Um, Gunnarsson's been growing. He did pick up a little niggle in that game. He picked up a tight half. Um, but yeah, for everybody that hasn't watched the previous episode, you should go watch the previous episode because there's going to be a man that's not there and you're going to think, well, why? Um, hmm, and that's interesting. I didn't know that Lucas Lopvat was suspended. I didn't know Stefan Nishkin was suspended. And I've now got Tom, Tom Mix is not registered because they can only register three people. Fun. All right. Callum Adair is about to play in the Champions League, ladies and gentlemen. And ladies and gentlemen. Um, this is the main reason to put Tom in. I already had a left back in, and even if I take the left back out, I'm only allowed three replacements, or three new guys, so didn't see the need um, of making it all crazy. Um, geez, so many people suspended. Moreno can come in, Magnuson can come in. I'm just going to try and uh, do this. Or we'll put you on there. Interesting, interesting, interesting spot to be in. Um, it definitely means that Nishkin and Elite, that means that it's our best partnership right now. That's uh, This is going to be interesting. Um, Replus is injured as well. So we're slightly under strength. Robert can't sit on the bench. Oh, wow. Um, well, I'm guessing it's just that. Martin has to go in there. Um, Wes Isberg. At least our first 11 isn't that bad. Going forward, it's sensational, but at the back, we might leak some goals. It's going to be a tough fixture, that is for sure. Um, hoping to play a better, better side around. Repes is still injured and will be injured for another five to ten days, but he should be back for the second leg. Um, obviously, all the boys suspended should be back for the second leg, so we're really looking to keep it tight here in the first leg. As it's Bonanin, Kanan, Gunnarsson, Isberg, Neves, um, Brian Orov. What's his first name? Yeah, we're not pronouncing it, but Brian, how's it going, Brian? Elder, Nikolai, Jimmy, Wagner, and Arneson. Um, look, we're just going to have to make do that back four, apart from Wagner, is a whole reserve slash third choice due to suspensions. I didn't realise we had that many suspensions at the back, or so I would have made sure Tomic was one of the boys that was in there. Um, is that a, who used to play in there from um, Icelandic League? I swear. It was on loan at FH at one point. I thought so. There we are. Just name look familiar. Um, as we know, this is a very good RBL side, but we'll click through it quickly. Kaore, who is still there from last time. Um, I actually think Divock Origi is new. Um, he wasn't there last time we played him. Fun. Good old Divock. I'm a Liverpool supporter. I actually would like Divock to stay this year. And just over Solanke, please. Um, I do think Solanke has potential, but not ready yet to be in and around the team. As Maximilian Mai looks like a freak. Um, Ozcan, if anyone remembers, got five assists in one game against us. Um, Salt, well, I didn't play that game, I don't think. 
Babic at the back playing at left back, which is actually good for us. Obin is a very good centre back. Um, Dayot, if anyone's never used him, is an absolute freak. Campy is campy, and obviously we've seen him like in goals. That's our lineup. There you are. Jimmy apparently has changed colour hair, and there we go. We are going to go and pick off where you left off last time. The boys are like, yeah. Um, can't give him the get revenge because obviously the last time we did play right, um, Leipzig, we did win at home. And that's what we're hoping for now. Let's get hyped, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to take a sip of this coffee. Donny Deng Veek. I'm glad you're not playing because, man, you are a very good player. They picked him up for Ajax for how much? 51 mil. Wow. Ajax didn't even use him. What? That's, what? That's strange. Oh, he went to Arsenal 51 mil. Then they picked him up for 35. He's not playing much first team there at Arsenal. Shame because he grows into a really good player, as you can see. Um, look, we're just focusing on ourselves, mate. I don't really care. The HK Stadium, the new HK Stadium, which we've seen before. I just love the look of it. That it's all, you know, we've got a roof on every side of the great of the stadium now. And there's fans and there's room to expand. It's sensational. It's Origi's going forward, and it looks like Maximilian Meyer. It looks like a chance first up. My oh my god, he's got numbers there. Oh, the the cutback was poor. Wagner clears, and that would be the end of the highlight. Thank God, I thought we conceded enough to one nil. Copenhagen played Man United in the other game that's in the Champions League today. Just looking for us to keep it, but I don't know what's about to happen. It's a head of fat post. It's kind of there and it's kind of blocked. It's a bit weird. It was bubbling around. We're not doing our best. Origi with a chance. It's a great challenge by Brian and Wagner will get this one cleared, hopefully. And can we just get through the highlight? We can. I'm, I'm not expecting too much with the team we've got at the back, but maybe going forward we can pinch a goal or two. Um, I think it's a game we're going to have to ride like. As Callum Adair's done well, and Kane and his ball inside finds Gunnison. It's a good ball for the Bornini. He's got great pace, Bornini. It's tackled, but it's fallen to Isberg. And 1 0, Hakuning Isberg against RBL in the first knockout round. First blood HK. It's been all, all RBL Leipzig. All RB Leipzig this um, first 10 minutes. Bernini, Bonini with a great touch, not Barini, thank God. Um, Bonini with the first touch there, it was quite good. Looked to get away from his man with his 16 um, pace, 17 acceleration, but didn't. But a free kick, Salva, he plays it inside the Taore. Taore's probably got the chance to cut it. Oh, Jimmy's done well. Can Jimmy clear? He does. Is Isberg down there? Isberg is in running at the, boy, at the ball and now running at his man. He's got that 17 pace, plays it inside. Neves, Bonini's inside. Bonini scores and his first actual goal for the club is in a... European first knockout game. Wow, we're two new up. Two goals inside two minutes. Sensational break from the boys. Gives it through to Isberg. Isberg now gets it. It was a great ball inside. Never's first time. What a ball. Barini with a great first touch. And he doesn't miss that with the 15 finishing he has. And there we go. And a highlight from kickoff. Can we put the pressure on? Don't concede now. Just put the pressure on. That's a good ball over. And Barini's there. The flick on. Oh, Jimmy's done so well. And it might fall to Kanan. Can we go forward again? Brian Neves now. He finds Kanan. Kanan, can he play it inside? He can. Bonini now running at his man. Still Bonini. Still Bonini. It was a good run, but not the best of finishes. And it's 15 minutes. And we're 2 0 up here against RBL. There we are. Arneson out here to. Wagner, Wagner, the back to Jimmy, Jimmy to uh, Brian, Brian inside the Neves, Neves now to Gunnarsson, Gunnarsson looks for Bonini, it's not the best ball, it was behind him, it's hit him and it's now fallen to Taore, the ball over the top is cut out by Nikolai and Arneson goes along, um, don't have much of an aerial presence up there so they're going to win that one and that goes to Barini inside the Taore, Taore with a good first touch, Taore's effort straight up John and Mr. Jon Arneson will hold on to that, very very uh, attacking game so to say, it's very open I expect it to be with the back four that we've got out there today. Apart from Jimmy Wagner, it's not the best back four. Origi's finding lots of space and lots of room. The ball inside Taore has gone down and Jimmy's apparently pushed him. You see, he get given a lot on football manager, so I'm not surprised. And can maybe Jon Arneson do us a favour in goals? An away goal make this very interesting, obviously. But can Jon save it? Jon can't. Origi puts it in top corners. And it's 2-1 HK. 22 minutes in, what a tie we're in for. Origi with a great penalty. Yon can't get there. Possession is very even. Which is not new. Wagner's picked up a knock, but without Stefan Nishkan, we don't actually have a right back as well. Just see how much um it hurts not having the depth in for the Champions League. We should have the depth now, but it looks like we've given the ball away and it looks like it will be. I'll be able to recycle possession. 
and he looked to go out the other side. There's a long ball. We're actually decent in the air at the back, though, and we do win it with Jimmy Neves. k runs inside, looking for a pass. In the end, he's... Oh, my. If we can see like that, I'm going to absolutely flip it. It was a good ball, too, to Wagner. It's hit. Oh, my. And it's bounced back to Taylor. Just give him the goal, FM. There you go. FM being freaking FM. Try not to swear there, but that is really frustrating. Just... Oh, my. Like this actually happens in real life football. It's just, you know, oh yeah, the pass is going to my right back, stays side centre mid, he's going to cross it, hits Jimmy, and falls straight back into his path perfectly. And it's now 2-2 after 30 minutes. What a game of football we're having here, but really frustrating goal to concede. And now it might be RBO again. Maya, his ball inside of Teore. Teore now, really look to strike when he does, it's just wide. Knew we were going to be up against it, but conceding on that second one, I like that, was really frustrating. Jimmy Wagner, he's ball to Neves. Neves, can he whip in a ball of quality instead of finds Isberg? Isberg gets tackled, but it falls to Bonanini. Falls back to Isberg, it's cleared though. And Jimmy Wagner maybe with a chance here to recycle possession. And can he? Just go all the way back if you have to, good boy. There and he'll find Yon. Yon now. Yon's ball to Wagner. Wagner, Jimmy. Where are you going to go, Jimmy? Jimmy inside the... Other Jimmy, Jimmy Hanlon, and Hanlon's passing isn't the best, and we're giving it away. Origi's inside here, Origi running, Origi with numbers. The cross is back post, they've got numbers. Origi's put it into the bar from point blank range. Getting very lucky. Wagner clears. Isberg up the line, can he get there? He can't. And it's the end of the highlight. Just get us in the half time. Everything is happening. All the boys are getting uh, they're getting shown up a little. Ever since we went 2 0 with it, a 2 0 up. Origi and Co from RBI have stepped it up. We did concede quite a cheesy, cheesy second goal. But it's 2 2 and on the balance of play. Probably flatters us a little. I'm far from pleased with what I just saw from the team. We're actually going to go to tactics and opposition instructions. I've had enough of Origi running at me. I'm going to just apply that there to every single person. I don't care that we're on yellow. It's going hard. I don't just play well in the second half. Only thing is, is the only person we could bring on here for Jimmy is having a shocker. Even though it says he has a 7.5, it doesn't look like it. Martin, um, Magnus has picked up a knock. It looks like it'll be a potential fire injury. He's going to have to play through because I don't have a backup right back on the bench because we have no Stefan Mishkan. Um, Simon Lemine could come on here for Kanan at some point, the uh, new signing. He's been quite good in pre-season coming in, playing as the inside forward, growing in that position as well, training him before it so he can become natural in it. I do think it's better than him playing as a striker with that 10 finishing as well. I think it will suit him more. As the long ball comes through, and it's won by Callum Edda, who's actually had a really good game there at left back. And in the end, the ball is cleared and it falls to Mawiji. And he's long ball forward again. Can we get up and win this one? Taore is huge in the air and does win it. Origi, and it's back to Taore. It's going to be a goal, isn't it? Oh, Yon, what a save! Yon goes huge, and it's still 2 2. What a tie this has been, let's be honest, ladies and gentlemen. It's a good clearance out here to Babic. Babic now. Over the top, Taore. Taore. Still Taore. His ball. And in the end, Yon can't save that one. And we're 3-2 down. I was just about to say, after the highlight, if we get through this highlight, we might change to a counter system for maybe the next 10, 15 minutes just to absorb some pressure. And then look to hit him on the break. Now we can't do that because now we have to score. Simple as that. We score. We concede another one. Tie is over. Um, Isberg. He plays it inside now. Brian, Neves, Gunnison, tackled. Gunnison's ball, he doesn't win it. All of a sudden we can't pass a ball and they've got numbers running everywhere. Barkley, headed away by Callum. And does it fall to Bonini? It does. Bonini doesn't have much on, but that's a great ball over to Isberg. Isberg's got the space to get there. Isberg back. Gunnison, oh my God, he's missed from point blank range. Should be 3-3. Free free. What is going on, boys? I'll tell you what's going on. Kanan's had a shocker. Lemine is coming on there to confirm that sub. In terms of everyone else, Brian's not having the best. I don't know if we actually have a centimeter on the bench due to injuries and suspensions. Knocked down. Barkley is there. It's headed away from Callum. I'll happily take 3 2 right now, only because I know that we got well, our first team pack for the second leg. But 3 2 away from home. Oh boy, I'd, it'd be better with 3 3. The highlight still goes in Jimmy. That's a ball to no one, isn't it? Oh, no, Fleming's got pace. Could he get there? He doesn't. Campy there gets it. And they should recycle possession, and they do. The highlight's still not over, so I'm guessing there's going to be a highlight for them. Barkley owes can. There we are. Jimmy, oh, my God. Jimmy, what a poor header. And Taylor's in. Yon with a good save. What are you doing back there, boys? 
feel like we're gonna have to move to a different system if we wanna try and get something out of this. I'm just not a fan of it. You know, we know how well this system does work, but maybe the boys just aren't good enough to play this system today. Jimmy apparently is on a seven. He's been the worst player on the park. Everyone picking up bookings. Um, we are gonna change the system. We're gonna leave wingers in. Um, Gunnarsson we're gonna leave. Neves is gonna come off on a booking. We're gonna put Brian back into the center. We're gonna play that. We're gonna get Leo Pauli, the man, the myth, the legend on a poacher. Um, we're then going to go team instructions and we're going to go very deep. We're closing down sometimes at a much higher tempo on Lourdes. We're not playing out from the back. We're not looking for that. We're not looking for that. We're looking to pump it over the top, exploit the left and right and hit early crosses with more direct and pass the ball into space. Um, more expressive, get stuck in. And we're just looking to just get the ball in the box for these two. Um, Fleming and Isbe running at their men. Callum Edder is going to play as a wing, a wing back or full back on the fend, and Wingman is going to play as a wing back on the fend. And there we are, we're actually going to put Callum as a wing back on the fend. He can play that role. But there we go. Confirm that change. In terms of anyone else coming on, I don't see the need. Um, Bonini's had a decent game. I don't think there's enough on the bench to bring on anymore, so we're just going to let this go out. We're just going to hope that this creates a chance. Doesn't look like it is. I'm happy you were at three two. Look, on the balance of play, they should have a little bit more. Rizzi picks up a slight injury. And look, a fourth right now would be very harsh to take, but it probably is deserved. As Jong picks the ball up, and maybe, maybe, maybe we could create something on the other end and get the three three. That would be important. That would be huge. As much as that means three away goals against us, it just means that if we win that second leg, we are through. Leo Poli now, he's ball inside, and of course, of course, just hits my player and falls back to him. It, it, why has he not controlled that? It's obviously meant for him. Well done, football manager. That cross is coming. Jons with a great punch. And Brian can kick that one long and looks for Leo Pauli. He's got Benini. He's got pace. Go, Benini. Good first touch. Benini. Oh, why are you trying to shoot? Take another touch forward and cut it. 3-2 still. We've created enough to maybe score a third. But at the same time, we've leaked so much of the back with a... You know, not the best back three. It, and see, it hits them and it falls to him. Jimmy, he goes long. Leo Pauli's come on. He'll play... Say Flemin. Oh, he doesn't. He finds Brian. Oh, what a touch that is from Gunnarsson. Inside Bonini. Isberg. Hacking in Isberg. It's always Isberg. It's always that man. And free, free HK RBL. It is always Isberg. Always believe in Isberg. He's never leaving. 100 mil asking price after this game. I'm doing it. Isberg. He is sensational. Well, look at that touch from Gunnarsson. He missed the Gilded Edge touch. Bonini with a great first time ball. And Isberg, he doesn't miss. That 10 finishing is a liar. There should be a clutch stat, which means in the 90th minute, your stat goes up. All these stats go up to 20, apart from his defending stats. What a man. I love that man. Two goals for Isberg on the night. 94 minute. There's one minute left in this game. Do not concede, but if we win the ball, go score. Wagner might get there. Okay, so I'll make a run. Isberg's down the line. Bonini's got pace. Go. Play Isberg first time. Isberg. Can he cut it? Isberg. Still Isberg. Leo Pauli. Yes, it's in. 4-3 HK. We've stolen it at the death. Come on, boys. HK4 RBL3. What has just happened? Lads. What did you just do? We have won the second, the first leg 4-3. We beat him 4-3 previously at home last year in the Champions League. Leo Pauli, I think, has gone to Chester in. I don't know why he's just not headed at home. Oh, that's what made me stammer that a ball went in. I actually thought the keeper got back there. That should be game over, ref. Just blow your whistle. Mick Fard, fix that one on. Can we win it? Jimmy wins it. Brian, Isberg, Jimmy, Brian, over the top. That's not going to find Bonini or Isberg. Can you just blow your whistle, referee, please? Get us home. Get us home, please. Oh, my. Come on, get us home. Teore, he's offside, surely. Yes, he is. Oh, it's a gashed upper leg. Well, Jimmy, you're going to have to play through that. Come on, blow your whistle. It is. It's 4-3 HK. What had just happened? What a tie. What a game. Believe in the Isberg. Oh, my. I'm proud of that performance. No one gave us a chance. Everyone looks delighted. Isberg gets player of the match. He's just gone huge. He's gone clutch, ladies and gentlemen. He has gone clutch. Inbox of five. There we are. Wagner, seven days and two weeks. He'll be playing the, uh, he'll be playing the game. Um, there should be more out of time, sure. Leo, it's what soccer's about, and enjoy bold. It was an absolute epic. He was absolute truth and showed how good he was. Kalimene had a great game. Do you expect the increase in services? I don't want to talk about that right now because, look, we didn't want to really play Callum. All right, so we got Farkle, KV, and then RBO again. 
So for everybody on YouTube, we will be back for that one here, and just like that, you know, click your fingers and it'll be back. You know, we'll be back within a second or two. For everybody on Twitch, though, as a few people, I'll respond to the comments in a second of what just happened in that game. Um, we will have to, we'll go through the Firecourt and KF game as quickly as possible and get to the RBL game. So, ladies and gentlemen on YouTube, I'll see you guys in just a second. Well, YouTube, welcome back. Um, on stream, we've gone through the two um, pre-season games in between this sort of lengthy uh, wait for the Champions League. Um, in terms of how the stream's gone, the stream's gone good. Um, we will be playing RBL now in the second leg. Obviously, remember, if we won 4-3 in that first leg, as you can see from the team as game-saving just in a second, um, we've gone back to pretty much full strength. We're not 100% there. Neves obviously getting sent off. Um, and with Victor not being fit, Ori Magnuson, if anyone remembers Ori, has got a cut, has came in now, um, has come in now to sit on the bench, and Beer's come back onto the bench, because obviously he's been registered for a while and he can't take him out. Simon Fleming is one of the guys that's been there, he's pretty nervous because he's been called up. But as you can see, it's pretty much our full strength side. Gunnison's the only person I'm really worried about not making it through the full game. And Repos obviously come back from injury. I'm not expecting to make it through the full game either. But they might. I'm going to only make changes when changes are needed. Um, but yeah, very big day for the club. We're going to submit the team. We're going to go forward now. And here we go. It's going to be interesting. We did win both our games. They are playing the 4-4-2. Berkeley Ozcan is going to play up top. Okay. Um, with Teore playing on the wing. Apparently, he can play on the wing quite well. Look, he actually can, Mr. Taora. There you go. I didn't picture that. Van der Beek's back in. Horn, Auburn. It, it's pretty good. M, M, M. Vogel's back in goals, which is actually really good for them as well because their other keeper wasn't as good as him. We cannot allow complacency from the start. Someone looks stressed. Lucas Lockback, don't worry, mate. You're Brazilian. It's in your blood to be motivated. And he is. It's in your blood to play well at left back. His name's Marcelo. Follow his footsteps. HK4, RBL3. Here we go. At the Leipzig Stadium here in Germany. Can we do it? Last time we were here, we lost 9 3. Can we put in a better display, please, boys? United are winning 3 1 up. A quarter straight away. It'd be nice to score first. Inside of Gunnison! Gunnison on the volley and inside of three minutes, it's 1 0 HK. Let's go! I said it was good to score early. I didn't really believe though because look, we don't score from corners. It's a great cross from Isberg. They haven't picked up Gunnison. That's a great left foot finish. Sensational. Who needs Silvio Ragnoli? Honestly. His name's Gunnar Soren. And he cost us nothing because he came from our youth academy. I love it. Never minutes in. We're one new up and keeping the ball quite well. In, con in contrast to what happened last time we played him here, we were already 3 0 down. There we are. The ball down the line. It's picked up by Jimmy Wagner, who is one booking away from missing the next game. Philippe, here we go. Inside the Brian. Brian, can we keep this one? He does find Stefan. Stefan. Oh, he's lost out, Stefan. Origi on the hit. Origi scored. It's a mistake at the back. That is the football we like to play, but, you know, I just that happens way too much. Stefan's such a good ball-playing um, defender. I just don't know why. We're going to look back at this. Look, Philippe, it's a good touch. Brian, that's the right ball, right? And all Stefan has to do is take one touch and play it straight here, but instead he comes inside. I don't know why. It's just football manager making games very tense. Um, obviously, if RBL score next, you know, 5-5, five, five, they get through and away goals. We need the next goal. Um, but it's a corner. Van der Beek, front post, and that's Diot. And we are two, it's 2-1 two, on aggregate. It is 5, it's 2-1 on the night. 5-5 five, five on aggregate. We are now going out on away goals. And it's another corner. <sighs> just poor defending. No one there. No one is owning the front post. And we're back now to being level on terms, but out and away goes. We need to create something. Oh, it's a corner from Van Der Beek, headed away this time from Stefan. Obviously the defensive mistake hurts and then poor marking. We've shot ourselves in the foot. There we are, Van Der Beek's cross, back post. Oh my God, he's missed a header. Who was that? Wagner does not miss headers. Wagner's our best player. Wagner's wanted by everybody. Football manager, don't do it. It's now 6-5 on aggregate. Um, there we are, we need two goals, simple as that. We need to score three in the night. Um, I had belief when we scored the first one, but don't let it be a pumping, please, because we haven't been that bad. It's just been two defensive mistakes. The ball over the top, Barkley's in. It's going to be a good cross. Taylor's there. It's over the bar. We ride our luck. It's not looking good, boys. I reckon at 1-0 it would look good, but now it doesn't. We haven't created too much either. We're keeping the ball decently. We're going to have to stay on this system. Um, we will change back to the system that we did at the end of the second, of the second game to try and score two late goals. Uh, we're going to stay on the system. We're going to get him into the pep talk. I'm very simply just going to get very aggressive and tell him it was absolutely terrible. Um, 
Jimmy Wagner, not a player I've seen. Taylor Ray's come off, thank God, because Taylor Ray's are such a good player. I don't care who you brought on. Taylor Ray is better than him. Rep us inside the Brian. Can we score from kickoff? That would be nice. And the ball for the Ispegs are up. Oh, just a better ball to Bonanine, and we're in. Here we go. Still 3 1 down here, but we need the next goal. The next goal has to be HK. We have to create something. 53 minutes gone. We have to do something with the ball. It's not happening at the moment. 59 minutes. All right, can we get on the ball and not make a defensive mistake? Stefan, if you have to, just go long. And he does find Kanan inside there. The rep us. Rep us now. Finds Gunnison inside the Brian. Brian, he's got Bonini in space. Bonini now. Bonini with the pace. Bonini. Oh, why are you hitting it from there? you got goal side. Run him one-on-one -on -one and finish. I hate when football manager does that. Once again, Kanan's having another freaking poor one. Poor now. It's frustrating because we haven't been that bad. Berkeley, it's a great challenge there from Repass. One's the ball. Isberg now. Can we go on the break? Isberg inside the Brian. Brian now inside the Repass. Repass to Isberg inside the Brian. Brian, can you find a pass, Brian? He finds Repass. Repass inside the Gunnison. Gunnison back to Brian. It's great build up play. Can we please keep it? Bonanine, good little striker. Finds it. Repass. Repass is ball over the top. Finds Kane. We've got numbers in the box. Surely it's a good ball in. Kane ends ball. Bonanine's there. And it's 3 2. And this life in the HK boys still. Kane ends had a shocker, but what a ball that is. And Tito. I can't pronounce it. TT Bonanine. We're going to go Tito Bonanine with the goal. The star man for HK. The French striker that has all the potential in the world. Kane ends ball. Cuts that one. And Bonanine with no mistake. And there we are. 3 2. Can we do it? I would like the score right now. At 75th minute, we're going attacking. Getting ready to press the space bar. 72, 73, 74. Highlight. All right. I was just supposed to press the space bar. Can we win it? Ball up. Brian's big there. Red pass. Ball over the top. Eastberg. Go down the line, son. Put a good cross of quality. Eastberg. Oh, Bobby needs hit it over the bar. The chance came. We're going to now go for it. We have to go for it. Um, going to keep Gunnison on. Red pass have, uh, has... Come back from injury, and we're going to go for it. Red pass, Bonanine, there we go. Leopold is going to come in there. He's going to go as the poacher on attack. We know exactly what we're going to do. We're going to put the fullbacks now on wingbacks on defend. Wagner's on a booking. Wagner will miss the next leg no matter what. So Niskin will be playing right back if we get through. We're then going to go to instructions. All right. Deeper, sometimes. At very high at fluid. Not looking for that, hitting the early ball, pumping it over the top, exploring the left and right, going more direct and passing into space, being more expressive on attacking. Press OK. Anyone else that can come on here? I'm going to make the change. Let is coming off Kanan. Even the Kanan just set it up. Kanan has been playing quite poor. Wow, one goal is all we need. We will be out and away goals right now. One goal. Twitch tap, do you believe? People watching on YouTube, back on YouTube when you watch this episode, do you believe? When this man's on the park, you believe. Confirm. Can we get through? We've made the changes. We did just score. Bonanine just missed a one-on-one. -on -one. They've made three changes. One of their changes has picked up a knock. Can we get a highlight with 83 minutes gone, 84 minutes gone, 85 minutes gone, 86 minutes gone? Is it going to be a late highlight? The time is ticking away. Don't do this to me, game. Overload. Yes. Confirm. Team talk. Yes. Push forward, yes. Come on, give us a highlight. 20, it's all over, isn't it? We're going to go out on away goals. It's going to be so cruel. Two defensive mistakes in the second leg are going to cost us. Time's ticking away. It's going to be game over. It's not even going to be a sweat. It's full time. We're up. I can't fault the boys. We're out on away goals. We have not probably deserved to go through on the balance of it. We somehow pulled it out of our bum in that first leg, scoring two goals in the last two minutes of the game to get up 4-3. Uh, We've lost 3-2 here. 6-6 six, six on aggregate. Two defensive mistakes. Jimmy Wagner, our star right back. Our star right back. Everybody wants him. Hopefully no one wants him after that. Missing a header back post where he just doesn't clear it. He just goes un over him. And they score... And the defensive mate from Stefan Nishkan. Look, unlucky boys, it wasn't meant to be. They seem relaxed. They seem motivated. That's good to know. We did this in the first time. We went to the exact same thing, made the exact same changes, and we scored twice. We out on away goals. That's a kick in the teeth. I wonder who we would have got. It, look. 
people say there's no easy games in soccer. There certainly right rings true for this competition, but we stood a great, good chance of winning this one. So I'm not best placed. No, I'm not going to say that. We're not too upset. And because we're, we're never going to go far in the competition. Um, I'm delighted we have a performance, even though we didn't get the result. It's true. Everyone associated can be proud. It's the first time we've gone to the knockout rounds as HK. It's taken the year 2022. I'm expecting more from us in the future. You're expected to be on the wrong end of a hiding. Obviously, it's disappointing to lose, but we could please remember SK's to performance today. It's really mid Isberg. I don't want to comment on speculation. The fans love him. I should have probably said that one. It's just, oh, it's frustrating. We're going to finish off by looking over the fixture. We won 4 3 at home, scoring in the 89th and 95th minute to go 4 3 up. We then scored first here. We concede to two defensive goals, a decent goal, and then Tito Bonin scores and then misses a Gilded chance to make it 3 3. We changed the system, we had to, and nothing happened after that. Look, at the end of the day, did they bring on Renato Sanchez? Oh no, Semiega. I was going to say Renato Sanchez, what a player. On football manager, that is. Look. We're nearly into the league. In terms of everybody on YouTube, I don't know where we're going to come back next. In terms of everyone on Twitch, that's going to be the end of the stream as well. I'm going to go get ready for work. An hour stream, I told you it was going to be a short one. It's not usually what I do. Usually a stream for two and a half hours plus is the goal. Um, sometimes it's five. Ladies and gentlemen on YouTube and Twitch, if you haven't checked me out on either other platforms, so if you're on YouTube and you haven't checked me out on Twitch, there'll be a link in the description below. If you're on, if you're on the Twitch, the panel below the stream, check me out on YouTube. As this will be an episode, this will be episode 21. It's Damien signing off on both platforms. If you enjoyed the content, give it a like and subscribe or follow, depending on where you are. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I gutted, gutted Damien. He was quite annoyed, quite upset, but quite happy at the same time that we put in a great performance, that we're not gone through. He's signing off. Hopefully next time you see me on whatever platform it is, we've made a couple more signings, just a little bit more depth I reckon is needed. Um, I reckon now we're in a spot where we should rock through the Champions League groups, um, qualifying to get to the group stage every time, which is good for our balance and good for our money. It means we can upgrade the stadium and obviously put more money into the team, which will leave us in good stead. We are a fair way off winning the Champions League, but we're a lot closer than where we were at the beginning. Enjoy, ladies and gentlemen. Have a good one. Goodbye.